This is a demonstration to show what occurs within the 915 transmission as you're in neutral or as you move through, through gears. I'll start out with uh, the engine running, the transmission in neutral, and the clutch pedal released. So with the clutch pedal released, the engine crankshaft is connected through the clutch assembly to the input shaft and the input shaft rotates at the same RPM as the engine. So as it's in neutral, you can see first and second gear fixed to the input shaft are rotating first and second gear that are on the output shaft, but the output shaft is stationary because the first and second gears that are connected to the output shaft are on bearings and are freewheeling on that shaft. The first and second gear connect the output shaft to the input shaft as you shift into a gear. So I'm going to simulate shifting into a gear. This assembly, this shift rod gets pulled as you pull the uh, shift lever into first gear. So we'll shift into first gear and we'll watch as the output shaft begins to rotate. So now I'm in first gear with the clutch out and now I'm rolling down the road. As I push the clutch in, the input shaft stops, but the car continues to roll down the road based on the uh, rotation of the wheels. So as you're rolling down the road, it continues to rotate, uh, but the input shaft doesn't have any input from the engine. So as, you're, as you push in the clutch, the only rotation remains from your wheels rolling and being connected through the axles to the transmission. You shift back into neutral. It goes into the neutral plane for momentarily as you're shifting from first to second. And then, then the input shaft is truly freewheeling as the output shaft continues to rotate. And you'll notice as the output shaft and as you continue to roll down the road, that second gear can remain st static. So as you shift into second gear, it locks in place. You let out the clutch. And you're rolling down the road. The same is true for third and fourth as you shift from second gear. That temporarily goes into, it goes in the first and second shift sleeve goes into the neutral position and as you move the shifter over uh, this dongle moves into the to move the 3-4 shift rod and pulls the 3-4 shift rod forward to allow it to engage into third gear and as you roll down the road Let off the clutch and shift into fourth gear. So that's first through fourth and neutral.